I saw on your uh, I saw on your website that you were gonna stop using Game Maker. Um, not really. Like I will try to expand into other languages. Is that what all your previous games have been made in? Or? Yeah. Oh, okay. Nice. And then do you have someone else to do all the all the visuals for your game, or is that all you? Or? I do everything except for the music. Mm. Oh, cool. yeah. Like in. Uh, Asia. Well, first of all, that game is really hard. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not all that familiar with the, the shooter competition. Um, yeah, it's like these experts are judges, so I made it really, really hard. Ah, so okay. So would be entertained. It wasn't really meant for regular players. <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> <laughs> aesthetic to it. I mean, it is just what it is. Yeah. And, the, and that seems to seems to kind of be the case for all of your games. Yeah, I guess I try to make them a bit abstract and like incorporate a feeling into them. Yeah. Um, but they're mostly just experiments. So. Right. Do you have plans in the Do you have plans in the future to you know try to make a living off of your games? Are you going to continue to do freeware? Um. I would like to make some money from it, so yeah. I don't want a regular job. <laughs> right. <laughs> I mean, you have some such a variety of of, of styles of games that you've made. You know, you've made anything from first-person shooters to fighters to <laughs> to these kind of like top-down shooters. You know, what what games inspire you? To, to uh, make? I don't play a lot of games. I like maybe try them for a few seconds before I say something that. Looks cool. I usually think, hey, I could do this with that concept and like steal it a bit. Oh, okay. <laughs> and is it mostly uh, other games that influence your style, or is it, or do you watch a movie ever and think? Yeah, like David Lynch mm. uh, from *On the Medicals*. Oh, really? Uh, cool. Yeah. If you look at like, Twin Peaks, mm -hmm. there's this dwarf who speaks in reverse English. Uh, like, and I stole that. Right. Yeah. <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> So there you go. That's where that's where the reversed English came from. I'm going to go home and re-reverse it also. And see what that is. <laughs> who did the uh, Who did the voice of the reverse English? Um, I kind of stole it, so I don't want to. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> well, we well we we won't actually do that then. Yeah. How long did that one take? Which one? The first or the second? Oh, uh, the first one. Um, I think it was about five days or something. <laughs> nice. Second. What? Um, a week or two. I, mean, mm -hmm. I can't recall. Cool. <laughs> How long did you uh, work on Clean Asia for? Uh, that was three months, I think, mm -hmm. from when I started to when I finished. But there was a bit of a gap. Uh, okay. So. How long? Uh, How long do you think you've been developing games? Um, like four or five years. Oh wow, nice. That's a lot of games for just four or five years. Uh, actually, I made like most of them last two years. <laughs> really? Wow. First three wow. years, I was just making games at, in my room, never mm. shared them. Right. So, yeah. Well, now that now that your games are out there and like they're clearly getting a kind of response, you know, yeah. it's, uh, is that is that something that you always wanted, or is it something that just kind of happened? Yeah, that's kind of the purpose of making games to like mm. get attention and stuff. I tried them make movies and comics but it's really hard you have to have a lot of talent to with games they haven't been around for too long so you can still make new stuff